ReStore is a refurbishment facility based in Banbridge Household Recycling Centre. It's run by the council but it has its own branding and its own identity. The biggest challenge is selling it to the general public and to the Banbridge community because this was one of the first projects in Northern Ireland to have a reuse shop and a training facility on site. The council developed a dedicated communication action plan for ReStore which meant that we could work with the local press, work with councillors to sell a good news story. Staff training, signage, posters and leaflets all went out with the brand. The shop sells mostly furniture and electrical goods to the general public and also we uh, donate and sell to the charities in the local community. Approximately 2,000 items are sold through the shop annually and the recycling tonnage would probably be between 12 and 16 tonnes. ReStore has not only helped with waste, it's also helped with community relations. The trainees that come here are socially disadvantaged or have had problems uh, during their working life and it is very important to the community that we reskill these people and send them back out into the labour market. Restore contacted us to offer us the opportunity for young people to attend placements here and we have worked with them now for a number of years. It gives young people involved with the Youth Justice Agency the opportunity to complete service in the community and to give something back. The trainees are involved in loads of different opportunities, especially furniture, restoration and customer service in the store. There are many benefits for a trainee doing a placement within Restore. There's personal and social developments as well as the opportunity to develop the workability skills and it gives them an excellent reference going into the place of work. The council applied for a lot of funding to help us set up Restore. We were successful and got about £260,000 from the Department of Education and Learning. It's still completely reliant on funding. However, we are working at becoming self-sufficient by looking at increasing footfall and looking at increasing communication so people know that we're here. We're also looking at expanding our shop outside of the site and there we could increase sales and bring the money back into the project. The key piece of advice I would give to anyone that's starting up a reuse facility as this would be that they would have to sell it to the local community and also secure full support from the councillors and the management within the council itself. The biggest challenge of setting up a reuse shop on a household recycling centre has been the negative perception of the quality of materials that are coming out of the shop. Through communication and through the reputation, it speaks for itself. The quality is so good and it has been something we have been able to overcome. The ReStore has been really beneficial to both the council and public. It's not only helped the council meet landfill diversion targets but it's also something slightly different for public to use as a service instead of recycling and disposing of their waste. Restore has been the first facility in Northern Ireland to be taken on board by any council and it has been a fantastic success over the last number of years.